what is going on everybody thank you for clicking the link this is your boy crisis 20. if you have any aver media device uh of any kind any capture card or whatever you might have gotten this message the message where it says in the beginning the crl does not exist or has been revoked um and then it goes on yada yada so i'm basically here to tell you guys that there is a fix to it but it's a workaround it's not a general fix all right it's not a general fix so basically i have windows 10 i ha always had windows 10 and it was working fine and i'm using it with my ps4 uh, my ps4 for some reason it wouldn't let me record strictly straight through my aver media uh, capture card via hdmi so i had to record via other means but that was always known to me i could never record via my ps4 for some reason it was protected somehow I, I just didn't understand why but i never bothered to pay attention to it then i got the anniversary update anniversary update came this what happens so i hit uh capture and then all of a sudden boom i get this message i'm like what the heck is this so now i'm kind of frustrated going through all these sites whatever but guys i'm gonna break everything down i'm gonna just keep it 100 with you guys when i got the anniversary update i think it stripped something when the update happened and it did something to the certificates of aver media or something along those lines and now i'm not actually able to see anything from aver media so i think that's what happened um obviously when they did the update obviously something went wrong um but i think it stripped uh the certificate from aver media and now i'm not able to view my hdmi because this is with the hdmi port that i'm using it on that i'm using aver media on to view what you see here so even if you go back and try to see it's going to give you it again i was worried about the hoobla the crl the hdcp and the whatever this website is or whatever so you know the first thing you know you will go on that website to try to update this drm license or whatever but i get this you know a server error so i'm just like dag so i'm doing some research or whatever but this didn't work for me but it might work for you i'm gonna go through a couple of fixes here guys that they said to do so if you're having this issue try these and let let me know what works or whatever so you go to your c drive and then you need to go to your program data so you need to search hidden i just search hidden right here and open it up and then I just go to show and then hit okay all right so now it's gonna show everything now I need to go to program data uh, Microsoft now I have a DRM here so you basically need to go to the DRM folder but I have it in two locations I have it in the Microsoft folder and uh, I have it in this other path here windows and there's supposed to be a drm folder in here but i never had that folder in here to begin with you could make one if you want you know create new folder label it drm in all caps and label it drm in all caps you know you can do that um but So you can try that, uh, but basically if you see a DRM folder, you want to clear all the contents inside of it. So clear all the contents inside of it, restart your computer and try it to see if it works. All right. If that doesn't work, then, then you can try this. So the second thing you need to do is to use another connection, use, use another connection. All right. So you want to, instead of using HDMI, use composite component cables or whatever have you i mean if you use component um you're not gonna have hd or whatever but um but composite you'll have hd uh so basically what i mean the green blue and red uh cables to give you video or your 
red, white, and yellow. Those are the other connection choices you have that you can try to see if it works. If you have those type of connections, all right? Um, if you're strictly just HDMI, then you can't do any other form of cabling. Step three is to get a converter, all right? Any converter of any kind. Uh, what I mean by converter is if you have a HDMI to let's just say uh, DVI, you have a small little you have a small little converter. It one ends HDMI, another one is DVI, another side is DVI. So you put, let's say you put that in the back of your PS4 or whatever, or your device then now you use a dvi cable on the other end and then you have another converter which is also hdmi to dvi so now you have the dvi cable you're going to plug the dvi cable into the dvi converter part of it and then the other end hdmi so that you'll put inside the aver media part and that will bypass the hd cp protection that is causing your Aver media to pull up this message because it's a protocol that goes through the cable uh so you need to block or stop that stop that uh connection from going through any type of converter of any kind will work guys any type of converter will work so if you want to try that go ahead and try that you can also um buy a splitter so I went ahead and bought a splitter. I bought this splitter specifically. All right. Uh, basically, it's a HDMI splitter. One end, it has two. It has two HDMI outputs, and then it has one input. So basically, this part in here goes where the where you will plug in your your console or whatever your device you're using uh so you'll plug that in here so let's just say my setup i have a ps4 so i'm using uh hdmi cable from my ps4 to the to this device here to the hdmi input and then for the splitter i'm using another hdmi cable to put in one of these two ports and I plug it in my aver media and i'm not getting the error anymore once you uh start it up now and you go to capture now it's playing without the error so that's what fixed my issue um i hope that this helped uh um there's um there's other splitters um out there this one's the best seller obviously for amazon i'll leave the link below so that you guys could look at it but obviously it says here hdc complaint will bypass the hdcp signal so boom that's one reason why i got it but um also it does uh 3d support and other things like that and there's cheaper ones too if this is a little too expensive for you so by all means this is what fixed my issue again this is a workaround it's not an actual fix but I didn't know what else to do. So this is how I fixed my issue. But I'm okay with that. I'm fine. So I'm able to record and do my videos and everything like that. So yeah. So that's how I did it, guys. Thanks for watching. This is your boy Crisis20. And I'll catch you guys at another fixed tutorial. Peace.